1960 D. Lincoln sent with repunched mint mark D over D and double date small over large date. The double date, the result of hub doubling, is plainly visible under magnification. The mint mark D was punched onto the coin die more than once, resulting in a visible repunching or doubling of the mint mark. The initial mint mark placement was punched slightly off center, and a second impression of the mint mark was made, creating a distinct variety. It was sold for $1,463.62 with buyer's fee. Number 7. 1911 Proof Lincoln Cent. Graded as PR66 Brown by PCGS. According to Grading Service, the 1911 Map Proof Lincoln Cent has a very low mintage of 1,725. However, there are several other dates with lower mintages such as the 1909 VDB, 1914, 1915 and 1916 proof, all with mintages under 1,400 coins struck. The only other dates with a higher mintage are the 1909, 1910, 1912 and 1913 but even then, the highest of these only has a mintage of 4,118. Therefore, all matte proof Lincoln cents are scarce. This PR66 brown specimen ended up selling for $1,260. Number 6. 1949 Lincoln Cent. Graded in Mint State 67 plus red by NGC. According to Heritage Auctions, this spot-free superb gem red 1949 Lincoln Cent ranks as one of the finest pieces certified in the red category. The strike is sharp, complementing pristine satin luster and original copper red and golden tinged hues. I appeal is excellent. It was sold for $1,980. Number 5. 1967 Lincoln Cent in Mint State 67 Red. Bright, satiny surfaces are awash in fully original light orange luster. With nary a distracting abrasion or other blemish in evidence, the eye appeal and technical quality are perfectly matched for this superb gem. It was sold for $4,025. Number 4. 1922D Lincoln Cent with Weak D. Graded in Mint State 64 Red by PCGS and proven by CAC. 1922 No D cents in full mint red are virtually unheard of, and may require a second mortgage to purchase. While the 1922 D Week D is also rare with full red color, it is far more affordable. A beautiful honey gold near gem, nearly unabraded although a few minute carbon flecks are evident. The reverse displays a good strike, while the obverse is blurry, as is customary for the issue. The mint mark and Lincoln's shoulder are as struck from an overused obverse die. It was sold for $7,200. Number 3. 1937 D. Lincoln sent in Mint State 68 Red. This Denver issue is readily available in any red grade through MS67, but the current MS68 Red piece stands apart from the majority. Luminous, spotless, and unabraded copper orange and reddish surfaces display outstanding eye appeal amid boldly struck devices. It was sold for $10,800. Number 2. 1916 Proof Lincoln Cent. Graded as PR67 Red and Brown by PCGS. The 1916 boasts the lowest mintage of the matte proof Lincoln Cents after the ultra low 1909 VDB issue. Many of the 1,050 pieces struck have not survived, and any superb gem 1916 proof is a rarity, regardless of color designation. Broad, squared rims and matte luster characterize this piece. It is sharp, and the deep amber orange patina is mostly uniform across each side. It ended up selling for $13,200. Number 1. 1910 S. Lincoln Cent. Graded in Mint State 67 plus red by PCGS and proven by CAC. A mintage of 6 million cents was fairly typical for San Francisco in the early teens, though it would prove to be small in comparison to this coin series overall. Worn examples are fairly plentiful, though this coin becomes somewhat scarce in the higher circulated grades. Mint state pieces are much more plentiful than this mintage would suggest, due to a hoard that was distributed in the 1980s. Many choice and gem fully red pieces were obtained from that source, as the census data reveal. This highly sought-after specimen was sold for $73,135.12 with buyer's fee. There you have it, folks. Eight seemingly ordinary pennies that could hold the key to a hidden fortune. Remember, when it comes to rare coins, don't just see them as spare change, Think of them as potential investments. If you enjoyed this eye-opening journey into the world of coin collecting, make sure to hit that like button, 
subscribe for more valuable insights, and don't forget to share this video with your fellow coin enthusiasts. Until next time, happy collecting and may your pockets be filled with more than just cents.